So we've got with us today 2020 Dakar winner and beast amongst men, Ricky Brabeck. You're probably bored of answering regular Dakar questions, so we're going to make this a little fun. Myself. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so this is your first time in India. Have you had a chance to sample our traffic? Oh man, <laughs> this is my first time in India and I have not had the chance to experience traffic. Uh -huh. We have enough traffic in California. Oh, so you don't know what yeah. traffic's really like I if you haven't seen it yet. I to even go out there and look at it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you reckon you could survive 10 days of the Dakar on Indian food? Oh, yeah. Yeah? The Indian food is really nice. All um, right, okay. You know, spicy food is my favorite. Really? Okay. Um, I'm not sure after 10 days hand riding, I don't know how that <laughs> would work, but uh, I'd be up for it. All right, okay, cool. Um, of all the rallies you compete in, what's your personal favorite? Um, you know, Peru last year was really fun. Okay. Uh, Peru the last two years actually was fun. Okay. Um, as far as being a favorite, I'd say Morocco. Africa is really nice. Okay. All right. And if you could pick where the Dakar would be held, what would your pick be? Mainland Mexico. Mainland Mexico. <laughs> Sounds good. Your favorite rally bike in the world? I've only, unfortunately, I've only ridden, ridden your CRF 450. Honda. Okay. All right. If you had to pick any offer bike in the world. Then again, I've only rode Honda and Kawasaki. Okay. But. Um, you know, I would like to try all the bikes. Right. I'd like to try all the rally bikes and all off-road bikes, uh -huh. but uh, contract says not right. to, so. Okay, <laughs> all right, fair enough. Tell us a little bit about the Dakar paddock. Is there a lot of rivalry between competitors? Is there camaraderie? What's it like? I think, yeah, there's a lot of, you know, a lot of issues between riders, but okay. you know, me and me, I don't, I want to be friends with everybody and, and have fun and make jokes with everybody. Mm -hmm. So I'm not the writer that's like, oh yeah, no, don't talk to that guy or no, I don't really like that guy. But uh, no, I, I want to be friends with everyone. I mean, we're out there in the desert by ourselves right. all day, you know, so it's good to have, you know, everybody close to you and a friend. Okay. So obviously great year this year, no doubt about it. But are you worried that a certain European manufacturer might be back with a vengeance next year? Uh, yeah, there's going to be people next year, you know, yeah. aiming for us. But uh -huh. we're going to try to get back to work as soon as we can and, you know, keep them off our back. All right, sounds good. And of course, the win in the overall rally. But aside from that, a particular highlight, a favorite moment from this year's rally? I don't really have like a single favorite moment. Mm -hmm. um, however, I was able to ride with my teammates for, you know, a little bit every day, which was really cool. Okay. Um, you know, never in any rally did I get to ride with my teammates. And then this year in Dakar, I got to ride with one or two of my teammates every single day. And like, tandem wheelies. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So that made it really fun. Hopefully more of those next year. Hopefully so. Yes, yes. yes. Really fun. All right. Thank you very much. And yeah. cheers. All the best for the next year. Yeah, thank you. See ya.